This is how to make a timeline chart in Excel in two minutes. Let's select our date and our height and direction. The height and direction is something that you can play with and mess with. It's how far your words are going to appear from the axis. So we just inserted our 2D bar chart. Now we've moved it into place. I'm only shrinking it so you can see the menu. You don't need to do that. So first, let's go to data labels. More options. We don't want the numbers to appear. We want those to be our product stage. So we're gonna uncheck value and then check value from cells and select our product stage cells right in the middle there. Make sure you hit OK and let's close out of this window. Next, we need to format the blue bars. So we're going to click on those and go up to the format menu. And then our shape fill is going to be no fill. We want to remove that blue. Next, in chart elements, we want to go to error bars, more options. We need to select minus no cap, and we want to change the percentage to 100. Then let's close out of this box again. Next, we're going to click back on the chart and let's go to remove grid lines and axes. We want to remove the primary vertical. Now I'm going to expand it again so you can see what we're working with here. It's looking pretty good. So I'm going to shrink it again just a little bit so we can see the rest of the menus. Let's go back up to format. We need to change that middle bar, our main axis, the shape outline to, let's go with blue. And if you click on the width there, we can make it like a three. You can test what you'd like. Let's click on the error bars and then do the same thing, change those to blue. And then one last format here, let's change that main axis to be an arrow. So we're gonna go back into the format and off to the right is arrow. Last thing you need to do is make the chart title something that's logical. Let's go with dev timeline. Close that window, expand it, and there you go.